everyone, welcome back to my channel and welcome to this Vlogmas Day 1 episode. <laughs> it feels so weird that I would have said that because this year I'm going to challenge this Vlogmas thing. So um not sure if you know it. So it's a traditional thing on YouTube. In December, you're gonna um make video every single day since the first day of December until the 24th of December so uh, basically to record how you live life in December how you uh, celebrate this festive season and uh, like an event calendar thing to count down until the Christmas Eve so this year I really want to challenge it because when I was very late to, I start watching YouTube videos and I start watching a lot of Vlogmas um, when I was younger. So I was like, okay, if there's one day in my life, I really want to achieve it. So it's sort of like a checklist to do in my life or it's bucket list sounds a little bit exaggerating. I'm not sure, but I just want to try it and challenge it. So here we go. And the thing is, because I am not a full-time um, people working in YouTube, so uh, I still have a full-time job, I try my best to have video every single day. So some of them, uh, they record like a little while ago and some of them are like on that day. So it really depends on my schedule and how my work in December because after all, I don't want to affect the job that I have currently. And today, the first day of this episode would be coming along with me to explore the Christmas lighting in central London. And then I'm going to meet a friend later on. Uh, we're going to have a meal to go to Lhasa and then afterwards perhaps grab coffee and then we're going to the central region street to visit the angels the glorious angels and then yeah just feeling the christmas vibes in london and let's get started and i'm so excited to bring you guys along with me so stay tuned So my friends just ordered this corn rice noodles lasa and then I'm actually ordering something similar which is the egg noodles with the corn as well. So now what we need is a chopstick and also I saw there is some fried garlic or fried onion whatever. We're gonna take that and we're gonna try that. We just left the restaurant, it was so nice, I really love the noodles. We ordered lasa and then I think it is the first time after a few years that I have lasa again. So basically we went to that restaurant and we waited for like under five minutes and then the waiter gave us the menu to order first and then we went to find a table and the food was really quick. Just like we wait for like five to ten, five minutes, not even ten minutes, and then we try that, and it's so nice. The soup was so rich, so creamy, not very spicy, and I got the corn one, and my friends got the rice noodle ones. I got the egg noodles. It was so nice. I highly recommend it. I will definitely bring my friends to here again and try it again. And now we're going to. Bay, chill out a little bit and yeah that's all and later on after the cafe we're going to the main street not sure where to see some Christmas lights that's the plan of the day so follow us <laughs> Uh, 
Are you ready for the Christmas lights in London this year? Regent Streets have launched a mesmerizing Christmas lights display for the festive season this year. The glorious Golden Angels lights display covers the Regent Street and also St. James. The 45 angels flying over shoppers are covered in hundreds of thousands of LED lights. And it's so amazing that night we went there and we took a lot of pictures. And if you're in London, make sure you go there to check that out. Then here we come to the Canopy Street. This year's installation is called Canopy Celebrates. They are celebrating its 25th years of the Canopy Christmas lights. I assure you, this is the best illuminations they have ever had over the years. The dazzling globe, surrounded by floating planets, aims to raise funds and much-needed amenities for refugees and displaced people across the globe. The next stop is the Burlington Arcade. It is a covered shopping arcade in London, parallel to and east of the Bond Street from Piccadilly through the Burlington Gardens. It is one of the precursors of the mid 19th century European shopping gallery and the modern shopping mall. Can you recognize this iconic advent calendar in the center of London every Christmas? Yes, this is the Fortum and Mason, the London Freshship Store. And we are heading to its Christmas shop with the Christmas food on the first floor, decorations on the third floor, and outside of the building, let's have a look on the Christmas window display. There are loads of the options for the Christmas presents, Christmas scent candles, skincare products, body lotions, etc. wrapping into an oven calendar. How exciting! My name, my first name, Sun and the Moon together.
Shira, hello. 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 <laughs> He's very cute. I really like all the Christmas tree decorations here. They are with high quality, very shimmery, unique and just pretty. I will definitely come back to get some more deco because this year I'm helping to decorate a Christmas tree. So Fort Mason is the place I will visit again later this month. So this is the first episode of the Flopmas in December. I hope you do enjoy that and feel the Christmas vibes in London. If you want more festive content and want to know how I celebrate winter season this month, please do subscribe to my channel, of course like this video and follow my Instagram. I will see you next day. Bye!